Hello everyone, it's Shane Kanto, your Wasteland reviewer, and I'm here to review The Silent Stars Go By, Doctor Who by Dan Abnett. And this, pretty sure my brother bought me this. It's been so long, I just had this pile of books for three years and couldn't remember where I got most of them, but my brother's a big Doctor Who fan, and this was an interesting leather-bound classic from Barnes & Noble, and with a pair of tails from Doctor Who, and I'll be getting to the other one, but this first one, The Silent Stars Go By, is a 11th Doctor story, so like Matt Smith, and we have the 11th Doctor, and we have the Pawns, as they're trying to go back for Christmas, and they're stuck in this icy, icy place, and what's causing all this tumultuous weather, what's killing the livestock, there's a bit of mystery here, and it's an interesting place to be stuck. It's very fitting for the time of year, especially that I wound up reading this, which was very fortuitous. And, you know, you have the 11th Doctor and you have the Pawns. They're fun and engaging protagonists. We enjoy being there in this adventure with them, trying to figure things out. It's very much the sci-fi fantasy kind of world that Doctor Who offers up with different people from different places and this one's filled with ice warriors and all kinds of fun things that go along with this desolate icy environment. Like I said, there's some mystery. I think it's some well-composed mystery that keeps you on edge enough. You know, this is still like um, creature of the week or like adventure of the week kind of story put into book form and it has its moments it's accessible and easy to read it has you know those fun elements of this other world and cultures and stuff like that and as we peel back the layers we get to learn more about this world that our doctor and his companions are stuck in and I've never seen any of the Matt Smith Doctor Who, so this is my first foray into his tales, and I had a lot of fun with it. And it's exciting, there's some good building of tension, and leaving us off with a sweet little ending that is fitting for the season, and I had a good time with this, and I definitely recommend it. But those are my thoughts on... The Silent Stars Go By. Let me know what you think and let's talk some books. But thank you as always for tuning in and supporting your Wasteland Reviewer.